Pilates series for telemotion. But this one is more based on my chiropractic care. I work with a chiropractor, and that allows me to think about the body just a little bit different than maybe the average fitness professional. So one of my big things because of my chiropractor friend who challenges me constantly to keep people upright is doing things that'll help you through space and time. So what better way to do that than to get set up against a wall? So what we're gonna do is take our heels back to any wall you have in your house. You may have to move a painting, some of you ladies. I know you like to have a lot of decorations, but the main thing is, is to get an open area where you can do some movement. So the first one we're going to do is take the back of the hand, place it up against the wall. Your thumb, pinky, and wrist should be touching. Make sure your chin is tucked under. And you can try to get everything on the wall, but if you can at first, don't force it. Just go with what you can get, okay? Everybody's built differently, and some of us can get flat, and some of us need to get some space. So from here, we're gonna lift our arms up to shoulder height. Inhale deep, exhale lift. Inhale down keeping the wrist, pinky, thumb touching. I recommend doing five at shoulder height because for some of us, that's as high as we're gonna get. But once you feel that range of motion open up, then I want you to go as high as you feel. Now, as a man, I'm a little tighter, so you can see I can't go straight up, but I do have some clients that can go all the way up and touch those thumbs. But I recommend keep working on this because the more you work on being in alignment up against the wall, it is going to help you with your overall posture. When you step away, you'll feel that lift that we want you to have. So get to, get to working on your wall posture, guys, because it's one of my favorite go-tos to help people improve overall posture.